about 130,000 kilos of cucumbers each year. So this facility consists of three core technologies. It is saltwater cooled greenhouses where we utilize salt water to produce fresh water and to cool and humidify the air inside the greenhouses. That means we can utilize all the good sun here in Jordan without all the heat. Then we have outdoor revegetation zones where we cultivate the soil uh, with uh, native plants building up the biological contents and storing CO2 from the atmosphere into previously barren land. And the third component is solar power that provides renewable energy to all of these processes. I think this is um, a project that has great promise for the future and it's impressive to see how technology can be used in such a sustainable way uh, to produce uh, agricultural goods uh, in uh, a quite tough climate uh, like here and how we use um, um, salt water, uh, make it into fresh water uh, and we use uh, solar panels uh, as a way to get uh, um, clean electricity um, and we produce uh, these cucumbers that are right behind us. So it's, it's quite impressive and hopefully it will be possible to scale this in the future. المشروع يحاول كمرحلة تجريبية لإدخال مشروع يعالج قضية التحديات محاور الغذاء والمياه والطاقة من خلال مشروع سيستطيع تحويل الصحراء إلى مناطق زراعية باستخدام مياه البحر والطاقة الشمسية والبيوت الزجاجية المبردة من مياه البحر وزراعة المحاصيل ذات القيمة العالية لتزويد السوق المحلي وأسواق التصدير هذا المشروع بالنسبة لنا بالأردن مهم جدا لتنمية منطقة وادي عربة ومناطق زراعية غير مستغلة بسبب طبعا شح المياه و درجات الحرارة المرتفعة. We need to combat climate change. We need to uh, ensure economic growth, and we need to deliver on the sustainable development goals. And this project uh, is uh, a project that has uh, huge potential of uh, contributing exactly to that. It's a fairly small project now, but uh, in this region there is potential for scale. And uh, what the world need now, it needs now is really innovative approaches that can uh, make use of what we have in abundance to uh, produce uh, more of what the world needs, and that is food and a better environment.